Greetings everyone, welcome back to Age of Empires Definitive Edition with me, Kemsit, continuing on with the campaigns. Today we shall continue also with the Genghis Khan and uh, the Horde Rise West. And uh, as you can see we have already finished the three orders and um, so we're gonna just continue on as where we were last time. So let's see how it goes. The Horde Rides West. Sleep in the saddle, drink the rain. Eat nothing but dried meat, dried milk, and horse blood. Such is the life of a Mongol at war. At night, we are rewarded with fermented yak's milk and the promise of Persian treasures. Driven on by the words of the great Khan, we have crossed miles of the Asian continent at full gallop. Before us lies the vast empire of Persia. The Khwarezm Shah will be given one chance to submit, and then his cities will be pulled down brick by brick. But not all of us head into Persia. Genghis has sent Sobotai Batur of the reindeer people north into Russia. The Russian principalities are disorganized, and Genghis hopes that Sobotai can break them one by one. Then the Horde will rule all of Asia. So let's see how this goes. We basically have to um, get going with this. Uh, so in the south, Khwarezm Shah is expecting a gift, but he will be assassinated in our trade cards. We must deliver the card to Shah quickly before he breaks his alliance with us. In the north, de deploy Superdai's horde to conquer Russia. Superdai must survive. The hints are Genghis Khan is restricted to a population of 125. If you assassinate, attempt fails, the leadership of the Shah will guarantee that the Persians are much more deadly enemy. The Persians are expecting their gift. If they do not receive it soon, they may eventually declare war on you. Your two armies are divided and will not be able to meet until they reach Samarkand. So that's the Persian capital. Your scouts report the Mongols first orange have gathered in the east near the summer count and construct a small camp, another Mongol army camp to the north that horde is led by Superdai who tasked to invade Russia. Not far from Superdai's camp are a land of the Kipchaks. The Kipchaks are nomadic people like the Mongols but considerably weak, weaker owing to the inept leadership. The west of the map is controlled by Russians, three red. They could be a serious threat early on, but in the long run, the Russian swordsmen and boyars will stand no chance against the Mongols. Beware their powerful rams, however. The Shah rules the Persian Empire for yellow from the Samarkand. A heavily guarded and fortified city to the south of Persia will defend themselves fiercely, relying above all of their mighty war elephants, mounted archers, and heavy cavalry. It is very likely that they will also produce siege weapons such as trebuchets and scorpions. To defeat the Persians, with the Mongols will have to destroy the Shah's palace, Wanda, and all of its castles. Great card. Our assassins are concealed in these trade cards. Once the cards are near the Persian Shah, the assassins will strike. Without their leader, the Persians will fall like grass beneath our hooves. That's good. So let's just first scout around. I'll start also producing some of these things. Uh, actually, hold on now. Let's get a wood. More vital. Uh, we have three villages over here. Send some of the More sheep. We come bearing gifts for the Shah. You may enter. Our city of Samarkand is just over that hill. Good. And we'll kill the Shah then. Let's uh, scout around and keep our people occupied with woodcutters. As the sheep are here, I'll uh, scout around more. Come on. There. There are some bears here. Kill them. I'll just send these that way. Because um, these things... Ah, damn it. 
we're stuck. Okay, uh, more villages coming in. Wood is uh, s coming in as well. We're nearly at the Shah. Ooh, I can see his men. Let's just try to kill the Kipchaks. Shh! And what have the Mongols sent me? No doubt a bride begging me not to destroy them. What is this? Treachery! Now the Persians will be an easier target. We die for Genghis Khan! Good job, we've done it. Now we have also captured a uh, small camp. We're doing a good job. If only I could uh, make some castles soon enough as well, just to stop their advance in case they do. So I'm therefore, we're gonna... It's attacking me. Oh, so we'll kill it. So we have more animals, I assume. Yes, we do. Cheap. Plentiful. I'll send you here. There and there. So keep scouting around, we have idle villages, that's not good. I'll send more villages. There we go. We could make a few cavalry archers and some of these. Let's upgrade it in case we need it. I'm not gonna fight with the uh, the enemy at the moment. Here, yes, okay, we have 10, so we're gonna start making some more um, villages to gather some food now. Five people on stone, come on, go for it. And we're nearly there. Kimo, oh shit. I'll need actually a few more villages here, okay, there, here. He's shooting him, that's not necessary. Um, let's scout around over here. Continue our scouts over here as well. Ah, damn it. Well, some of these can also be useful skirmishes. More people over here. How many stone getters do we have? Nine. Only a few more. There, they are attacking. Okay, that's not so great. Um, I don't even have military buildings over here, so that's a problem. But I'll have five villages make some stuff over here. And that's a castle. I'll keep these guys at this place just in case they do something. There. I'll need more villages over here. Start sending some villages there actually. There, that's done as well. So the castle should be done quickly and we'll be able to defend ourselves from one side. This side is also easily defended. I'm gonna also start scouting around. These horses though. There's plenty of gold. More villages. There. We have plenty of stone as well now. We can make two castles even. But not now. As I have uh, other plans to do with these. I'll actually even pick up two guys and place actually a castle here. Just in case. 
and then I'll move a few more people here. There, now it's done. I'll make a mill over here. This castle should shoot these guys down. Come on, come here. Shoot them. Right, uh, I'll need even a Zekher um, blacksmith just to check how much my attack is actually and a library. We have more idle ventures, that's good. Not really. Okay, we're gonna kill him quickly. And start hunting food. Zekher is Job! Auto recede. Timu! Virtual Idol! Amor Mindu! Amor I'll uh, regroup my troops over here quickly. Shit, I need to also get us some gold quickly. Because I don't have it. But... Oh shit. Oh, leave my guy alone, please. Come on. Keep moving. Oh, damn it, I don't have this research. Too bad. Well, I'll have it in no time. I'll make Mongo dies. I'm having a bit of trouble over here, so... I'm gonna quickly try to replace it quite a few things. There we go. Idle villages. There's some gold over here. Please go for it. Um, you can get a wood. Gold. There we go, murder hall has been researched. Shoot it down. That's done. I'll quickly now re redo our stuff. We're stopping them. Okay, now uh, let's start re uh, repairing this. I'll make some more mango dice just in case. Um, I'll even make another town. Oh. I'll need to have more attack against these guys. Hold on. And repair this. How many villages? Two. Okay, we'll increase this. Increase that. Repair is done. Uh, send some more people this way. Four. Increase this. 
will meet whole sorcery things. Himu, beating bad. Barlachung forms. Himu, Barlachung. Sacher, Barlachung. Himu, Amor Mindu, Barlachung. Let's research everything we need up. Damn it, I don't have enough wood. We'll need it eventually. So. We'll have to send some more people to wood. Or they're just gonna gather it quickly. Come on. Uh, we'll also garrison some more archers inside these buildings. So we won't have any problems. Good, gold is coming in soon. I'll also be able to advance to the next age. And this will mean that the enemy will have some trouble with me. I'm okay, there we go. We're already having some problems with uh, resources. Let's just empty them. Come on, I'll scout around just to find the enemies their uh, position. Um, wait, where is there now? Right, yeah. Jesus. I have no stone, that's not good. Alright, I mean wood. Great. More woodcutters, please. Come on. How much is this? Okay. We'll send a few more here. Start scouting around. There we go. I'll need people to gather more wood, Watching. please. Quick. I'll need rams, definitely. Um, and for such, I shall do it by making this. Or I can just advance to the next stage and make some uh, things. Uh, horse arch is the best, so let's make some cavalry soon. How many are these? Ten. I'll send some people this way because there's enough wood here as well. Building bad. Done. I really need more wood, come on. Yeah, here they come. Right. Welcome, my friends. Good job. We have finished them. Only more archers, two more uh, battering rams, more lumberjacks over here. Amr Mindu, Mot Chung. That's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more villages and wood over here. Good job. Timu. We'll have plenty of time of uh, doing this over here. Come on. I'll actually even create a uh, uh, stable, two even, if I had the time. There we go, researched, archery should be upgraded, and fire, that's fine, um, yeah, we're good. Our arch is gonna get stronger now, and we're gonna go for it, okay. Make some uh, trebuchets actually, hold on. Mm. Oh, vital. Or there. Shad, shad. The Russians are not so stronger than me here. <laughs> Three. Another stable will be vital. Um, I'll make my horses stronger. Uh, 
cavalry archers, yeah, there we go. Shooting should be also better. Second. All right. Magnificent. Now that I have also this, we'll be able to kill him with a trebuchet. Oh yeah, two even. Okay, uh, super ship. Right, these two will be useful for me. Fire upon them. Ah, oh, shit. We've done it. Good job, people. Sheesh. Right, we're destroying him. He's gonna give up soon. Yeah, he is going to give up. That means we can just start besieging the uh, other guy from the other side. Russians are defeated. I'll quickly start to make some more troops from this side and besiege him. I can even besiege him from two sides, so that's what I'm going to do. Even. Because he killed my villagers. He'll pay for that. Okay. Right. I'll make a lumber camp over here actually. Um, uh, I can go back to get gold. I won't need that much more villages, so we'll kill a few. Because gold is depleted now. Since gold is all gathered over here. Uh, shoot him down. There we go, good job. The others are gonna get food. Where was it? I saw some. Yeah, here we go. I'm Jim. I'll improve my um, thing. There. Now we should be safe. Oh, hold on. This seems to get. Okay, we've got it. Let's upgrade this as well. I'm not mean to be thinking shoot it down. Want to hold up. Let's get you guys to gold. Where is it? There we go. 
We're gonna need it. Alright. We can now enter the village. I mean, the places. advancing and destroy that castle quickly shoot that guy down shoot these people down kill them all come on okay uh I still have full population cap. Um, there's some more swords over here, which can quickly regain their spells. Shoot it down quickly. Right, we've done it. Quickly, just attack this gate and open it up. Come on. Go. The town center is destroyed now. We've done it. Alright, he has destroyed one of my um, stuff. Let's move them out. Now we can enter the place. Dismiss this. Timu, be boss for you. Hunting. Some more food, come on. There's a tower here that needs to be destroyed. I'll quickly destroy that one there. Eventually need more um, treasures actually, so let's make them. His priests really go away. Amr 
Mindu. Amur Mindu. Right, we're gonna kill these guys because we have too many people. Uh, let's start moving out. There we go. Now we have more troops. We should charge in again. And continue these charges. Sieges gates, because uh, yeah, here we go. Let's just destroy his wonder. Seems he won't go down without fight without a fight, so that's no problem. I'll just right. Stop it. Besiege this castle. Stop the villager from building this. Kill him. There we go. He is done for. Start besieging these lands. For his um, stuff over here. Isn't there any other villages over here? I want to check. Yes, there is. Right. Okay, you guys can go over here and get the gold. Come on. Should have killed these guys already. Like, why is he not dying? Shoo. He has already lost nearly everything. Come on, give up. Let's go for it. Open the gates. Why are you guys staying in this place? Now, fire. Come on. There. There's no sign of their people. And the gates are open. So now we can continue and destroy their people. I think, if there is any more. Good job. That's another castle down. Start destroying this uh, archery range. There we go, we finished, finally. We'll leave them out. The Persian army numbered nearly half a million men, but was beaten by a Mongol army less than half that size. The governors of outlying cities were executed by pouring molten silver into their eyes and throats. The capital city of Samarkand, which was expected to withstand our siege for a full year, fell in five days. Separate mountains were made of the skulls of men, women, children, horses, dogs, and cats. We roamed the streets in wonder at the opulence of the Persians, drinking at their fountains and gorging ourselves on sherbet and tropical fruits. 
for a man born in a tent. It seemed as if Genghis Khan had torn open the gates to heaven itself. Russia and Mesopotamia were now ours to command. The empire now stretched over 7,000 miles, from the Pacific Ocean to the Black Sea. We were about to enter Europe when tragedy struck. Now that's it, we have finished one more game of uh, Age of Empires. Uh, this uh, we shall see what kind of um, struck has happened. Till then, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give a like button and subscribe to my channel if you're new and wish to recommend something or record a game together that's possible. Just write down comments box below or add me on Steam and we can have a chit chat about it. Till then, I'll uh, see you guys later.